Can you change the color of your bicycle? Of course you can! It's super easy, with some help from a grown-up, of course. So if you're interested in learning how to spray paint your bike, or anything else, then this is a perfect show for you! It all started with a little evening meditation and a delicious cup of tea. Daddy? Mm -hmm. I was just thinking about painting my bike green. What do you think? Hmm? You think it's a good idea? Mm. And most importantly, do you think you can actually paint it for me? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Daddy. I know only you have the right experience. Uh, because I think you're the only person in the world who spray painted his car uh, this olive green and then uh, you gave it a few touches with that camouflage color. That, that was actually pretty nice. Finally, when you guys got that silver car, I think you spray painted it again somewhere in front of a supermarket. Am I right? Mm -hmm. So that's what made me think that Spray painting a bike is actually a piece of cake. Well, the only way to find out was to wake up early in the morning and get started with the project. Uh, what you will need uh, is actually something to clean the bike with. Uh, I recommend industrial degreaser that gets rid of all the oil. Uh, you will need some cloth or paper towel and of course gloves to, to stay nice and clean. Then Daddy recommended uh, a, a sandpaper that will help you kind of roughen up the surface of the bicycle. Uh, we started with number 200, which was really rough, but then we finished with number 1000. We also got this primer that will help the main paint to stick better, so make sure to start with the primer too. And here is our paint that we actually found on the street. Someone threw this out. We have the green color for the frame, black for the wheels, and this golden one for some final touches. And what we have here, oh, oh this is a really cool tool that helps you hold the, the spray paint can uh, once your finger is hurting. And of course a masking tape uh, that will help you cover some of the areas uh, that you do not want to have painted. All right, let's get to work. Here is my bike. As you can see, we started sanding it already. Uh, it looks pretty good to my eye. Okay, let's see the details so far. Mm -hmm. I think we're gonna be washing it next and then painting it with a primer. After washing the bike, uh, we decided to use the masking tape uh, and cover some of the most important areas that we do not want the paint to land on. For example, the holes from the screws, the cables, the seat, the handlebars, you know. I think we're ready to start painting. Before you use any paint, make sure you're operating in a well-ventilated area, because the chemicals coming out of the spray paint can be dangerous. So make sure to wear a mask too. After reading the instructions on the spray paint uh, and shaking the can for about two minutes, Daddy started painting. Uh, looks like he is applying a really thin layer of the primer first uh, by pressing the button at the top of the can. Seems pretty easy. And he said he doesn't really worry uh, that the paint will go on the spokes from the wheel because that's what will be painted as well. After about 20 minutes of painting, we took the bicycle outside uh, to make sure it dries well and also to look at it for any imperfections. From here, it looks really good. I think we're ready to start painting in green. For this part of the project, we decided to stay outside. We taped few garbage bags together because we do not want the paint to go on the grass. Hey, Daddy, are you ready? <laughs> okay, what's next? Any ideas? 
Well, uh, we're gonna take the wheels out just because we wanna focus on the frame and start painting uh, with the black color first. That will be easiest. I suggested to Teddy to keep some parts black, like the stem post, uh, the crank set, and even uh, the rear rack, because it would be nice to have some contrast on the bike. Not everything needs to be green. Well, I'm not really sure about this. I thought we were gonna go green, full steam everywhere. But let's see what it looks like. Okay, let's do it. I'll just shake the paint for Daddy. And... What is that? Kitty, go home. You don't want to end up with a, with a paint on your fur. Shush, shush. Go, run. Hey, Joey, what's up with the music? Well, there you are. Hit it, Joey. Much better, Joey. Thanks. All right, let's get back to work. Uh, we have to cover uh, some extra parts, uh, like this front uh, derailleur uh, or the shifter that changes the gears. Uh, and then, once we have that covered with masking tape, we can start painting with the black color. Daddy, stop! Kitty! Seriously? Alright, I think we're good. Hey, Daddy, just, just a question. Why are you not removing all the parts? Yeah, that would be the right way to do it. Um, I just don't have that much time. I'll be more careful with the green color, I promise. Okay. Oh, and this is the really cool tool that Teddy was talking about in the beginning. If your finger starts to hurt, while spray painting, you can just snap this tool on top of the spray paint can and your job will be so much easier. Alright, so once the parts that we painted black uh, are all dry, we can actually cover them with paper towel and more masking tape just to make sure that the green paint doesn't splash on those parts. Okay, okay, okay. Are, are we ready for the green paint now? Let me take a look. All right, that is covered. That part is covered as well. The wires are covered. Yeah, let's do it. Hey, Daddy, what about the wheels? Uh, let's do those black, no? Okay. Yeah, I think black is gonna look really good with the green color. G -g -g -guy, guys, uh, th this exceeds all of my expectations. Um, shall we look at the bike? Check this beauty out. Oh, my. I, I love it. I'm speechless. Daddy, when it's dry, can we put it together? Yeah, of course. You can even take it for a spin. Really? Okay, I, I will, Daddy. Thank you, thank you so much. Let me just fix this tripod that, you know, the camera keeps, keeps falling. Let me, let me just adjust this. Oi, oi, oi! Is this broken? I'm too tired for this. I'm going home. Just few final touches. Got this rag on eBay. Amazing deal. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present you with the bike. It matches nature perfectly. Alright, I, I think it's time to go for a ride, no? Can teddy bears ride a bicycle? Of course they can! Alright, alright, no tricks this time, please! Nice! Teddy likes. Yoo-hoo! See you later, alligator! Hi guys, hope you enjoyed the show. And if you see Teddy, please tell him to come home, okay? He's been riding this bike forever and I am a little worried about him. Just joking. Anyway, that's all for today. Uh, but I promise that we'll have much more coming up this year. So make sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell button so you don't miss a thing. And in the meantime, stay safe, stay healthy, 
and keep learning from everything around you, especially Mother Nature. Thank you. Bye.